Robotic hair transplantations. Is it the future? I don't think so. I'm going to give you a few reasons why a robot is not quite better than a human just yet. Number one, punch size. The robot uses a massive punch, almost double the size of a punch that we use typically in an FUE surgery. This means you'll experience almost double the scarring. Number two, it can only extract out of a limited area, namely the occipital area, which means that you may be prone to being over harvested. Number three, it is extremely slow. It can only extract about 1,000 to 1,500 follicles in a day, whereas a human can extract upwards of 3,000 follicles in a single session. Number four, the robot does not have the dexterity of a human hand that can make micro adjustments during the extraction process, which limits transections of follicles. Number five, the robot cannot oscillate, meaning that it only has a rotational setting. This makes it difficult to extract curly hair, which the robot cannot do. Number six, it can only target colored hair, which means that if you have gray hair, a robot will not work for you. The robot has many, many limitations, but these are just some of the most important ones. I would not recommend anyone to use a robot in their hair transplantation surgery. It is more of a marketing tool. So please do your research.